Well, I pursued a career in teaching because, um, as I, you know, when I looked back at my elementary school years, I enjoyed them. I had friends. I had um, a positive experience. So um, it was always in the back of my mind to become a teacher. Um, I didn't become a teacher right away, meaning that that wasn't my um, my major. I kind of went in a roundabout way um, and came back to it. A lot of a lot of family members are teachers, so I think I was fighting just becoming, um, you know, part of uh, the family. But it really was for me because I, I like learning as well as teaching. So you're always learning. It's it's uh, it's not a boring career for sure. Teachers are a vital part of our society, and even though the job is rewarding, the occupation does have its challenges. As of 2023, many are worried about a teacher shortage, and here are some of the issues that are associated with this. So, there are about 3.1 million public school teachers in the United States. 74.3 of the teachers are female, while just 25.7 are male. The average student-teacher ratio is 15 to 1. The majority of teachers are white, while 9.3 are Hispanic, 6.7 are Black or African American, and 2.1 are Asian. The average U.S. public school teacher salary is around $65,000, and it could be lower than that. And teachers spend about $700 to $800 of their own paycheck on school supplies each year. Every day, every day you see change. Every day you um, will, will, because you know, being a teacher, you, you have to have this um, inner determination to make something work. So you are trying different ways of, um, you know, getting your uh, lesson across, right? Getting the um, learning objective across. And when you see that spark, um, when you see the kids gain confidence, that is a huge reward. Everyone's going to be shouting out an answer. Pay attention. And the directions are divide in unit form and in standard form. Okay? So, listen for the first one, and then you're going to say the answer. 41 divided by 5 equals... 81. I like being a teacher because it's very active, it's creative, it's um, it's it's ever changing. Um, different, you know, you you're it's a different group of kids every year, different programs. Um, some people um, can be steered away from the change, but I I um, I like the challenge, um, and I, I you have to like working with kids. And I work in elementary school, so I do, you know, enjoy um, the quirkiness that goes on at times and all the, you know, every class is different. So it brings, um, you know, a lot of spontaneity into the job. I don't think I'd like to be doing the same thing over and over again. Even though you're teaching the same subjects, it's always, um, it, it's always a different, um, different program. Um, there have been years. I've been teaching for 29 years, and there have been some tough years. I'm not going to lie. And yes, um, you begin to, um, you know, rethink what you're doing with your career. However, with teaching, um, and I do work in the, um, a, a, a bigger school district, so you do have choices that you are able to um, change a grade um, or the different positions available, um, coaches, or some leadership roles that you can also, um, you know, pursue. So there is um, some variety going on if you do feel like you need to change.